having a baby. Good everybody, welcome and welcome back to my channel. We're having a baby. Not me, specifically. My brother and his partner are expecting a baby any day now. And ever since they told me that they were expecting, I have wanted to do one of those testing pregnancy craving videos so that is what we are doing today I asked my sister-in-law what her cravings have been during this pregnancy and she actually hasn't had many she had three that she could think of so I decided to turn this video into a more 24 hours trying my sister-in-law's pregnancy cravings type thing so yeah let's just get into it so for breakfast I had her first craving which was just a regular bowl of cocoa pops I like Cocoa Pops so this wasn't like a big challenge for me and yeah it was just a nice chocolatey treat to start my morning. Moving on to lunch, I almost died. One little fact about me, I can't handle spicy food at all, not even a little. So you can imagine my uh, distress when I was informed that one of the things that she was craving the most was spice and rather than talk over the video of me eating my lunch, which was megaring noodles with the spice packet. I usually have it without because, again, can't do spicy. Topped with cheese and salami. I'm just going to show you the clip because I think it speaks for itself. I'm a big girl. I'm a big girl. I can do this. I'm going to make sure to get some salami too. Mmm. salami which is still like somewhat spicy to me and the cheese kind of dullen the spice but the noodles are ridiculous and this is <laughs> it's the mildest flavor and I got mild salami too but it's still I my mouth is on fire <laughs> uh, this is for the guy that does hot wings <laughs> if I ever get famous the answer is no. No, I will not come on your show. No. And lastly for dinner, now this one I already kind of had a feeling that I would like because it's two things that I like already put together, but I thoroughly enjoyed it. It's nachos, just like regular nachos, however you would make it, topped with pickles. And I, I, I was thrilled. This happened to fall right on a time when my brother and his partner were coming over for dinner. So I made it for all of us, minus the pickles for my brother, and it was delicious. I think I'm going to start adding pickles to my nachos just like all the time. It's so good. Now because there were only three cravings that my sister-in-law had, my brother decided to throw me a bone and give me one of his ideas, um, not his ideas, his cravings that he's been having during this pregnancy. because. Apparently sometimes the dads get cravings too. And I made his here as a lot of a uh, bonus treat. It is chicken satay mega dumplings. Apparently they're dumplings. They look like pork buns, but they're chicken satay dumplings topped with Vegemite. Now again, I like Vegemite and I like dumplings usually. So we're just gonna, we're just gonna see. I don't know, I quite like that. Maybe he's not crazy. Another bite just to be sure. No, I really like that actually. Oh, hang on. Hang on. Mm, there's a little bit of a kick to the aftertaste. Anyway, that is the video. Very short, very sweet. Me taste <laughs> testing pregnancy craving food and liking most of it. As for my little niece or nephew coming soon, auntie can't wait to meet you. Auntie God, mum, can't wait to meet you. I already have my sweater, my in my auntie era sweater, and welcome to the world. As for everyone else, peace. Bye.